Hello and welcome to Go Game Yourself. I'm Jordan and I'm going to play a wonderful little indie game called Boxcar Brats. It's very simple, it's a racing game, kids in boxcars crashing into one another, they're completely out of control. Let's give this a go shall we? So off to the starting grid, I am the little guy in the green car with his delightful orange stripe up the middle. Well, not the middle, up the side. <laughs> I don't know where the middle of the things are. So the object of this game is to make all your other opponents crash out of the game either by making them crash into you when they go too fast or by slowing down and being the slowest. And how do you become the slowest? Well, you crash into stuff and you build up that meter you see in the corners. That's your brake meter. And once that's filled, you slow the hell down so that the others go past you and hopefully into one another. And as you can see, you have three lives uh, to try to win the race, and I'm about to lose to the little red-headed girl who has beaten me on many occasion. And I mean in the race. Nothing weird. Green Racer! Rolling start! That's not quite a rolling start. It's more of a static one. So yeah, you crash into hedges, trash cans, hay bales, cardboard boxes and anything else that will build up that meter so you can slow down and hopefully everyone will get ahead of you and fly off the screen and leave you as the victor. Boxcar racing I think is a it's a very well to me anyway it's always been a very American thing you know where dads will go out with their sons and say son we're gonna make a boxcar I'm gonna send you careening down a hill at a high speed without any way of stopping or slowing down and hope that you survive. It's called character building, son. It'll make you a man. Or maybe a dead son. Or daughter, let's not be sexist. And it looks like the little kid in the red boxcar has won. <laughs> oh, and he runs over a red-headed woman just to show how much he likes redheads. The only downside of this game is that there is only one track, but I would if the developers ever see this video, this is my message to you. Please make more tracks and, you know, add more to this game because it is wonderful. And it's a, for, especially for racing games, it's a really nice idea. Oh, I'm beaten again. I lack focus and skill. I think the kid in the red car just run over the redhead's mother. She wins again. She's a bit too good. Bum, 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 slow down, slow down, slow down, don't crash, slow down, don't die, slow down, slow... Was I going backwards there? Something weird was definitely happening. Okay, oh... I'm not very good at this. Ready, set, slow... Already I have lost a life. So yeah, you really want to avoid smashing into the back of people, especially when your car is going fast, because that will lead to you losing a life, and, uh, and I've lost another one because I was too fast. Too good, some would say, or too terrible. Now, if you slow down and other people are going faster than you, and they go into the back of you, they will also lose a life, so, like so, that was nicely planned. Nicely executed. So with regards to laps, like in other racing games you have laps or, you know, the race ends. There are no laps here. This just keeps going until, you know, there's only one kid alive, I'm guessing. I don't really want to say that because that's really, really horrible and grim, but I guess that's the truth. There's only one kid on the track. That's when the race ends. When I'm getting out, oh, I was very close to winning that time. As Daft Punk sing, one more time. That's exactly what it sounds like. I'm a perfect Daft Punk impersonator, except that that's a blatant lie. I've lost another life. Oh, I thought I was slowing down. Having said that, I did make a couple of other crashes happen. Quite pleased about that. Oh, I keep getting ahead of myself. 
I don't think that the... I'd say pedestrians? I don't think that... Um, crashing into them boosts your slow meter. It doesn't even give you a wanted level like it would in a Grand Theft Auto game. So I don't know what kind of... I don't know where the moral compass in this game is. Running people over is okay if you're in a boxcar and you're eight years old. Okay, so I'm in a good position to win here, and I have won! Success! Finally! And I, I, like, I had two lives. Go me! I rock! After my first victory, I'm greedy for another. Ready, set, slow! Okay, so I'm really lacking the slow meter here. <laughs> I'm really lacking the slow meter. That's the first time I've ever been able to say that and mean it. So it's between me and the redhead. Oh, she slowed down. Very sneaky. She's hanging in there. She's a fighter. She's a survivor. I am a slow driver. Ah, I almost run over her mother. Ah, and it broke her concentration. I am to winner. I win. As you can see, it's a very simple little game, but it's a really fun little game too. It's called Boxcar Brats. Link again will be in the description, so go check it out. But more importantly, thank you for watching. I've been Jordan and this has been Go Game Yourself. Stay tuned for more videos and don't forget to like and subscribe and share and tell people about how annoying my voice might be. Bye bye